Hi! In this video, I'm going to explain the difference between the first generation femcap and the newer, improved second generation femcap. There are very few differences between the first generation and the second generation femcap, but they're very important. The first one is that the first generation femcap didn't include a removal strap on the cap itself. What that meant was it made removing it a little bit difficult and also was less safe because you run the risk of accidentally scratching your cervix with your fingernail to, to get the femcap off. Fortunately, the second generation femcap includes a removal strap. So your finger doesn't have to come into contact with your cervix at all. You simply hook into the strap to remove it, makes it so much easier and so much safer. The second major difference between the first generation femcap and the second generation is in regards to the largest size femcap. So the largest size femcap is 30 millimeters. Um, that's the size of the cap itself the diameter of the cap itself, and it's designed for those who have given birth vaginally. So the older first generation femcap had a shorter brim. What that meant was there wasn't as much surface area for the walls of the vagina to close around and stabilize the cap. That made dislodgement more common and decreased the effectiveness rate of the first generation femcap. Fortunately, the second generation femcap is designed with a wider brim, so there's just more surface area for the walls of the vagina to hold and stabilize the cap in place, rendering it more effective. While Planned Parenthood only rated the effectiveness of the first generation femcap, the FDA approved the second generation femcap. And as you can see, there are really big differences between the two. The removal strap, the wider brim, rendering the second generation much more effective makes all the difference in the world, and it's really important to know the differences. I hope this was helpful.